Oh, welcome back and we have a new topic this called HSL hue saturation and lightness so HSL is stand for hue saturation and lightness so this is just similar to RGBA we are going to learn how we can just change the color through HSL so here inside these commands I'm just going to insert P tech P start and P close so let's just copy some dimmy text from Microsoft Word from here till here you can select Control C. I'm using Windows, so my one is Control C. And you can just save this, go to your web page and refresh. Just a very simple P setting here. So here you can just call your P inside the CSS style tag. And you can set the background color we are not going to make the video lengthy just direct to the point HSL you are writing just HSL instead of RGBA then this to round bracket semicolon here uh, you can just start HSL with three value you can say the first one is edge value hue the second one is S value which is saturation and the third one is L value which is lightness so the first is edge value I'm just giving for example 180 and comma so the two uh, last value you must give in just percentage for example for the saturation I'm just uh, using here a 30% and a comma and for the last one I'm just using 100% so you can just save go to your web page and refresh so you can see it is a total white background color and if you just increase the saturation value to something like uh, maybe a hundred percent let's check save and refresh so no changes but if you decrease this one to something like uh, maybe 20 percent save and refresh so you can see it is a dark blue color and you can just change this one also to 250 save and refresh now we have just another darker blue color and you can just increase this one to 80 percent save and refresh now you can see where you can select a different color here just by changing the value of hue saturation and lightness so this is very easy this is just up to you you can just increase this one to 10 percent and this can just give us a new gray color so you can just find this uh, from W3 is called HSL color or colors HSL you can just find from here so if you want to just pick a color and just some blue color so you can see the edge value is in 244 you can just increase the value of blue or decrease from here also so between blue uh, blue I'm just going to select this one to 69% and this one I'm just going to put this just lighter blue something like this so now you can see we have a complete code for HSL here the H value hue the S value saturation and the L value lightness for the H we have 245 for the S we have 69 and for the L we have 59 you can see 245 69% and 59% you can copy this and go to your web page and you can paste this instead of this one now you can save go to your web page and refresh now you can see we have the same color that we have here now we can just select any color something like maybe orange color let's just select orange and this one is just orange you can see the age value is 28 96 44 28 96 44 you can copy Control c to copy and paste instead of this this one and i want to just use a space here save and refresh now you can see we have just a pure orange color here so i hope you are understand this all the ways that you can just change the color for background and for the text you can just use rgba 
or you can just use HSL hue saturation lightness so once again I hope you have enjoyed watching this video so best of luck have a nice time and see you